so I can't even see. Uh -huh. All right, now. <laughs> Just raise this up and this whole thing is off. Ah! I am living in my prayer. A plaque real bad. Real bad, okay? Yes, girl. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, as you can see from the title, it's gonna be some type of an apartment vlog. I don't know. <laughs> I do know. I'm super excited because I finally got some dining room chairs. And if you're new here, hey, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave. So, we're gonna be putting together my new dining room. What is it? Come on now, come on now, come on now. We're gonna be putting together my new dining room chairs for sure in this vlog. Um, I'm gonna be spray painting some things. We're gonna be, I might do a little bit of cleaning and depending on if I wanna cook something tonight that's not something that I always show. Um, so yeah, we're gonna see. That's what I do know we're gonna be doing. And today I gotta do some timestamps really quick. I gotta post a vlog at three o'clock, it's 2.45. Um, today's Sunday, by the way. I'm not gonna really do a Sunday reset because I kinda already cleaned and organized some stuff last night. I did like re, what can I say? I did rearrange my kitchen last night. figure out how to maximize my space for my pots and pans and all of this stuff so I looked up my um stove and this isn't the type of stove that this is like a warmer this is actually storage so I was gonna they said not to place obviously any plastic and you know stuff like that that can burn under their steel but this is an actual storage so I'm not gonna put these under here i am needing more space for my lids but since this got this like rubber right here i'm not going to place those under there um instead i'm going to try to clear out this side so i'm going to be putting um my pizza pan i just used that today but my pizza pans i'm going to put in there so like this one and the other one i'm going to put and then here my bacon stuff i'm going to put down in here So what I'm basically trying to do is make my kitchen more functional. Um, so with me organizing different things right here, this is more functional for me. So I can easily access my pots and pans. I can easily get that and that and that. Okay, cool. Then this is storage. So I have all of my bacon and stuff down there. And then this is easily accessible also. So my cutting board's right there my little strainers and yeah 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 and then the lids is up top okay so for this and it is 10 22 at night <laughs> but this i'm satisfied with i need my spices right here accessible quick easy yeah Let's this. okay and then this goes right there so basically i'm not even basically using this space right here like <laughs> so what i'm thinking is I need my cups and stuff to be a little bit more easier accessible as well. Like I got my plates and stuff right here, Tupperware, well glass Tupperware. And then I got my new ones of these. I just finished washing them over there. So I'm gonna need this stuff to be a little bit more easier to access. So I think I'm gonna put my cups, um, plastic cups like these and what have you. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and try to put these right here so I can just grab. Um, and then my vitamins, I may just go ahead and put my vitamins in my bathroom so I can just wake up and take them because I do forget to take them because I don't open this up that much like every morning. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna move all of my vitamins to my bathroom. Um, I don't even know if these ones are still good. I'm not even about to, what's the date on these? They expire in 2024. So yeah, they're still good, but I don't really care for the Vitafusion anymore. So hit the phone away, but I'm just gonna throw those away. <laughs> Cause I like this brand. So yeah, I'm just gonna move all of this stuff and put my cups down right here. These need to go into my pantry anyway. 
So I'm just trying to make my kitchen a little bit more. So I'm doing my Tupperware. I don't even have a lid for these two containers, so these are just gonna be trash. Bro. I didn't upgrade it anyway, and I got a lot of glass, and then I got a lot of new ones right here. Out with the old, in with the new. Did I even see me here? So yeah, y'all saw that. And then I may do like some laundry and stuff today. Bay is gonna actually be here at midnight when he get off. So he's gonna come and then tomorrow's Monday. We're gonna go to my gym session and stuff together and then just whatever else tomorrow holds. Might go to the at home store and home goods because I do have a coupon for the at home store to see if I can find anything else for the apartment. Um, but yeah, kind of just trying to figure out what else I want to add to the apartment. May ask y'all's opinions on some stuff. And that's pretty much what I have planned for right now. So I'm about to add these timestamps into my video. It's my birthday vlog. Um, and I also want to say, I just got a comment. I've gotten like two comments on my last vlog asking about, they've been saying, well, y'all been saying, where's the other dog? Watch this video right here, please. Please, please, please. Catch up. Mm -hmm. Catch up. <laughs> because I explained everything there. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead and add these time steps it was something else that i wanted to tell y'all i don't know but i'm about to do my time stamps really quickly and then after i get done with my time stamps then i'm gonna go ahead and start putting together my dining room i probably spray paint first so those can be drying and then i'll go ahead and put together my dining room chair super excited because i think i did flashback footage of last night so y'all probably already seen me organizing so i've probably been talking for a minute now <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get off of here and then i'll get back with y'all when i get ready to spray paint so what i'm gonna be spray painting is my two candle holders they're gray y'all know my theme aesthetic whatever is not gray anymore i'm so over the gray so i'm just gonna go ahead and spray paint these black especially because you know it kind of already burns on the rim anyway black so, and I don't want to do white because if I set these on top of my, like, um, not countertops, but any of my furniture, like y'all know, my furniture is basically white, like my dresser, TV stand, my nightstands. So, I want to do black. It's going to look better black. And then that way I can use these because now I got these for a reason and I don't be using these because they're gray and I don't want gray in my apartment. So, I'm going to spray paint these black. I was thinking of spray painting my um, other little candle holder black it's marble so i'm like i think it'll be okay but we'll see but i'm just gonna go ahead and spray paint these first i think that's all that i wanted to spray paint yeah so we're gonna get to spray paint these i'm trying to be outside little amount of time as possible because it says it's 99 degrees outside so that's why i'm explaining the inside i'm about to hear up and spray paint these and get back in the house because it's hot then my pizza is almost done. I'm gonna eat some pizza and then I gotta go deliver, do a um, hair pickup order. Um, one of my coworkers ordered some hair, so I'm gonna drop it off to her. And then I'm gonna come back after that and then we're gonna build my new dining room chairs because I really don't wanna be interrupted while doing that. We the best music! music. Another one. Yeah. Ooh, and we're about to open up my new dining room chairs. Hopefully this don't take too long. I'm also trying to record a sticky top. Oh, I can't believe they sent these so quick. Alrighty. I just gotta probably screw the legs on then. Oh, take one of these out. Look what 
just say. <laughs> That shit platinum just like all of my releases, my girl. Niggas come for me, I tear them all to pieces, my girl. I'ma show your sexy ass what relief is, my girl. Please don't take no shit that's about that hype of weekend. And I'm not driving nothing that I gotta stick with keys in. Wonder how I got this, I swear I got the Just calling my phone like I'm locked up, nonstop. Turn the plane to the fucking helicopter, yeah. Cops pulling up like I'm giving drugs, ah, nah, nah. I'm a pop star, not a doctor. If the chair is fully complete, if I wasn't recording, that probably would have took like five, ten minutes. Because all you gotta do is just scroll on through. Oh. Breaking that. Okay, ah, I'm excited. This matches my couch so well. Great buy, great buy. Hello, baby. You see my chair? Bouncy too. Okay, so I put both of the chairs up. I did one on camera for y'all, then I did another on camera for TikTok and Instagram. So I'm just gonna place them. Ugh. Okay, I wanna go ahead and restock my napkins, but this looks so good. I'm thinking of switching out this decor because this is brown, and although my cabinets and floors are brown, it's just not giving anymore, especially with this placement. So I think I'm gonna switch these out for what yet, I don't know. I do have a 15% off coupon for the at-home store, so I'll probably go to the at-home store tomorrow and see if I can find some table placements. If not, then I'm just gonna take these off and leave it as is and keep these. I do like these though, like I don't wanna have to switch these out because it's still pretty neutral. So maybe just the bottom. I don't know, y'all tell me. Because since these are black now, I'm not feeling that no more. I'm gonna keep them here for the time. Actually, I'm not. Okay, I don't know if I wanna put them like this. So they're kind of like curved against the wall. So this is kind of open so I can walk back and forth comfortably to the like patio door and stuff like that. So they're kind of curved outward. Or should I? This is straight. And that's straight. <coughs> so do we like them straight? Or do we like them kind of curved? I don't know. I'm thinking I'm liking the curved look. But y'all tell me. This is definitely a 10 out of 10. Link for these will be down in my description box below because baby, one day shipping? Yes, ma'am. So the next thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and clean up my living room a little bit more, um, straighten up my pillows. I really need to get that pink thing out of here. I want a black one, so I'm gonna buy a black one, so act like that's black. I'm about to actually clean my table off. And yeah, just kind of get the living room put together and then I'm going to slip their sweep in here and mop and stuff like that really quickly. So I can do a quick little like, um, not transition, but I wanna like showcase my living room for like TikTok and stuff like that. And I want it like spotless and clean. So, and I don't know what all this stuff is on my pillows. So this I still need to sell or give away. This is my old little computer desk. Um, if Bay wanted, he can take it, but I don't think he need that for anything because I know for sure he's gonna be taking this little organizer right there. So, until so he gets here, I'm about to clean up the living room, dining room, and then maybe kitchen and see what I wanna make myself for tonight. Um, 
and maybe even him so yeah then after that i'm gonna shower since i've been outside like three times today and it is so hot outside it's like 100 degrees it's 93 right now the sun is going down but it got up to 100 degrees and baby it's been so freaking hot so i'm gonna shower and then i'll probably put on my food and while my food is cooking i'm gonna go ahead and review these glasses because all they want is a dedicated youtube video so all i'm gonna do is put a few curls in my hair and i'll probably do my eyebrows and put on some mascara or something but other than that i feel like like i'm cute like my skin is good <laughs> i don't need no makeup on really so that's going to be that this is the other thing that i was going to spray paint black but it's marble i feel like it's okay for now y'all tell me down below if i should spray paint it or not and my other stuff on the patio that i spray paint it is dry i touched up a few spots so i'm going to put it back out here when i'm done but should i spray paint this or leave it marble also wanted to say i'm actually about to start doing saturday resets because baby on a sunday i just want to lay in bed and watch all my youtubers upload their videos <laughs> like uh I could put on one right now, but when I start watching videos, it kind of get me distracted. So I'm just going to, I'll probably try to clean majority of my house on Saturday. I cleaned up and organized a little bit yesterday, but I'm going to try to do Saturday reset from now on. So I think I want to go ahead and move this stuff from under here. Um because it's just it's just not matching the vibes anymore especially since i don't have anything pink left out this is a book for literally just like me and my selfies and other pictures that i want in here and then this one is my traveling book i think i already explained this i need to print out some more pictures with um what is it free prints because i've been traveling so much since this this stops at like 2019 yeah so definitely gotta update that but i'm gonna oh, girl i just closed it and oh, my nails are so my nails are not thin but they break easily like i don't know how to explain it that was my real nail and it just broke off girl and it was so long that's why oh, that's so annoying fun fact if you didn't know my mom bought a yearbook for every single year of my life in school literally started from pre-k all the way up to my senior year in high school <laughs> So, I literally have all of these memories and also went to Seven Hills, middle school, high school, whatever. So yeah, I'm going to put all of this stuff up in these. I just wanted to know, do you know somebody named, you, you know his name. Oh yeah, definitely, I know his name. I just want to let you know that he's mine. <laughs> no, no, he's mine.
why is my bar stools um coming apart girl like i literally just raised this up and this whole thing is off um yeah that is not cute and this one only has one screw left on this one and then one that just fell off i don't know why this is coming apart and y'all know I didn't pay for these though. I got these for um, a review, but I really like these and I don't like that they basically coming apart. That ain't cute. Like, do I gotta use longer nails? What is it? Like that one still feels So I think what I'm gonna do is try some slightly longer screws because girl, this ain't cute. Cause this back one is not even like in here. Just look how small that is. So I'm gonna try one that's slightly longer. Um, I think I'm gonna do this one and hopefully it doesn't like go all the way in. I got my finger at the bottom cause if I feel something, then I'm gonna take it out. I think those would be better. I'm pushing my finger down and I don't feel anything. So I'm just gonna use these longer screws to fix this problem. Okay, so y'all remember this. I think I've had this for two different apartments, three different apartments, something like that. But I am gonna, I guess I'm gonna put it up here because honestly, there's nowhere else in here that I will put this that'll like actually make sense because I do have this wall, like this is my door, you come in and there's this whole wall right here. And I'm like, I don't really want this right here because this is where people walk and like I may, someone may bump this or whatever. So I think it'll just make sense to put it behind the door. I think I've always put it behind the door um, plus I kind of want something like really cute, decorative, like an art piece right there instead of this. So that's why I'm just gonna go ahead and put it up behind the door. Well, let me get my steps through, I can't even see! Why this always die on me when it just said it was freaking charged? Real ass bitch, give a fuck about a nigga. Big freaking bag, hold five, six figures. Stripes on my ass, so he call it pussy nigga. So if you guys remember these lights that I had in my last place, when I put these lights back up, I tried them and they still work. Let me do another test real quick. So yeah, they all still work, I believe. Cause I was gonna put these in my living room, but I don't really be in my living room that much. And I like having these lights on rather than like putting my lamp on. And it's just a vibe, like I really like these. I can't remember if I got these from Walmart or if I got these from Amazon. I'm gonna have to go look at my Amazon uh, orders and stuff. I wanna say Amazon. And if so, then I'll just link them down below because these are definitely a vibe. So I'm about to try to untangle these real quickly. And then I'm gonna, I was gonna wait for Bay to help me put these up but I mean I did it by myself last time it's just easier having you know somebody else to help you with stuff but y'all know me little miss get it done and little miss bob the builder so 
I'll probably just go ahead and try to put these up by myself because I kind of just want stuff done at this point and I don't like to wait. So when I'm ready to put these up, there we go. I'm making a change today. The liquor been taking the pain away. I heard you was giving your chain away. That's kind of like giving your fame away. What's wrong with you? I sit in a box where the owners do. A boss is a road that I've grown into. I love you to death, but I told you the truth. I can't just be with you. I'm only you. Yeah, I got one virtual, got one in that dead. The only two, man. How many times have I shown and proved, man? How many nights I've been woke? Okay, so it is 10 23 at night. Hmm. I said I wasn't gonna do a full Sunday reset and a full clean, and that's exactly what I did. Jasmine successfully completed her job. So my little I robot Jasmine, that's her name. When I say Jasmine about the clean, that's what I mean. She's done mopping the entire surface of the floors. Um, as y'all know, I put these up. Looking real nice, real cute. The vibes, especially when baby about to come. Um, didn't make my bed fully because obviously I'm about to take a shower and lay down. So my decorative pillows are still over there in the corner and it's just basic right now. Um, I did move this mirror over here. I don't know if I told y'all that because I don't know. I wasn't really feeling it over here because when I be trying to take pictures, I don't have enough space over there. So then I moved it over here so I can have enough space. And I mean, it already has a built-in light. So I moved it over here and I think it'd be cute to have that background. Um, so yeah, I mopped my bathroom floor, my master bathroom. I washed those rugs. I'm about to shower, so that's my stuff that I need to shower with. And basically that's it. My closet and everything always pretty much stays clean. <laughs> and I just cleaned my toilet and all of that. I got a little candle going. So in here, everything is looking really nice up in here, girl. When I tell you, when I tell you, if y'all know, I finally flipped my pillows around. I have never had my couch pillows flipped since I got this in 2021. I always flip them over so all the pillows can be black. I don't know what it is, but right now I'm kind of feeling it. I'm gonna keep it like this for a little minute and see how I like it because I was about to order some decorative pillow cases off of Amazon, which if I feel like popping them in here, I'll probably pop in what I'm thinking about getting. But yeah, I turned them over and I'm kind of, I'm kind of digging it, I'm feeling it. That white pillow and this white pillow came with it. This one and this one I bought, so yeah. The rug and stuff will be linked in my Amazon storefront. All the stuff from Amazon will be linked, but anyways, my living room, spotless. Like, come on now, I done dust and everything. Over here, I got them. I didn't wanna do straight. I think it looks better with it kind of, you know, leaning, well not really leaning against the wall, but kind of counter cornered, I guess. Um, so yeah, I like this look. And then Prince little stuff over here. She didn't mock everything for me. So it smells good in here. I wish y'all could smell it. And then, like I said, I gotta sell that. And yeah, I'm loving my new chairs. Super cute. And then in here, I did do some cleaning. I'm about to cook pasta. So that's why you see those pasta stuff over there. Um, she mopped all of this. Y'all saw me put that up. I am washing. So I rewash my towels. They're drying and then I'm actually washing. So that's doing what it do. And then I didn't clean my um, beauty room because I kind of already did a full clean a few days ago. Only thing that's messy is my desk just because I've been working and then Bay is going to take this out when he come. And pretty much everything else is clean. Like I completely cleaned this room up. So we good here. And then my guest bathroom, I told y'all I never really keep, like this never gets dirty. Um, if it does, I just automatically clean it. I was doing my hair earlier and using this earlier to wash, wipe my hands. So really all of this is always clean. I was doing my makeup, so the sink is dirty and I clean that. But as far as like stuff being out of place, my guest room, I do try to keep looking top tier. So yeah, that's that. I had a good little Sunday reset. I'm about to go ahead and put my pasta in this water and then I'm gonna hop in the shower. When I got the shower, I'm gonna clean these little few dishes right here, finish cooking and probably finish watching um, Raven Elise's new video um, that she just posted for her 30th birthday, her planning that. And by the time I finish showering, finish cooking and watching her show, Bay should be here because it's 10 27 he gets off at 11 it's slow today he says so he should be here by midnight um he has all of his stuff so he don't have to go home or anything so he should just hop right on the road 
that is if you leave like right at 11 <laughs> or like by like 11 10 but anyways i'm looking for him to be here at midnight so since it's about to be 11 um i basically got like an hour and 30 minutes before he get here so yeah i'll talk to y'all tomorrow today has been a really really good day i feel really really blessed also it's just that's just been on me like i've been feeling really really blessed here lately so i just want to say thank you guys for we're almost at 30k thank you guys for sticking around with me and for my newbies hi girl so yeah i have a few other things planned i'm trying to get more consistent again because baby i need 100k i need that plaque real bad real bad okay if you ain't subscribed and you watching this far baby go ahead and subscribe go ahead and subscribe thank you okay so i'm done talking um i probably won't pick up the camera again tonight because what would i be picking it up for i'll pick it up tomorrow um with me and bae i don't know if i don't think i'm gonna record in the gym i don't know we're gonna see we're gonna see i may take it to the gym since bae gonna be there and i won't be too like shy we'll see but i'll pick it up tomorrow for whatever we do tomorrow so ending it right here and i'll see y'all tomorrow You know bread and stuff in my system so got my water i never fill my water all the way up because i put ice in here so i wait till i go to the gym to finish filling it up because their water be hot so i got some in there and then there's some in the bedroom in a hamper so y'all know i like to go get my ham freshly sliced so i'm gonna give me a Quick little ham and cheese sandwich because I'm not really feeling breakfast food right now. My favorite brand of cheese tastes so good, like high quality. This little thing is five dollars, and these squares aren't big enough for my sandwich. But I don't know. I feel like they all kind of taste different. Like the cubes in this taste different from the slices, and the actual block cheese tastes tastes different. Huh? Uh, yeah, but it may already be in my car. I keep it in the car. Listen, I asked him, what are you going to eat? I don't know. He didn't tell me he wanted a sandwich. I said, I'm making me a sandwich. I said, I thought, in hindsight, I misheard you. I thought you said you wanted to stop and get you a sandwich. No, I said, I'm going to make me a sandwich so I don't pass out. You going to tell me no on camera? Can you make me one? Can you make me one? <laughs> I don't ask for a lot. I really don't, <laughs> I don't ask for much. What you want on your sandwich? You just, just, just like you did, right? Well, I only do cheese and... That's fine. Because I don't have all, my mustard. That's all I need. Well, I don't do no mustard. One thing you I want ham do. and cheese? Mm-hmm. That's it. Ham and cheese. I ain't even say you make me a sandwich. I asked you. See? If, if y'all want on camera, you just say maybe a sandwich. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Y'all know what time it is. You would have told me no off camera. You would have made it eventually, but you would have told me no at first. Where are you going? To my, uh, to my trip real quick. Why? Huh? 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 Take it with me. Oh. I'm going to go and get the cheese with me. Why? Now you want to toast it. <laughs> <laughs>
Me and Bay are back from the gym. We're eating Chick-fil-A. I'm about to watch Aaliyah's face while I eat because y'all know I gotta watch something while I eat. You got anything to say about the workout today? Ain't no joke. <laughs> Ain't no joke. Now you see what I be going through. It was a really good workout. I was in there for an hour, literally. We basically did full, full body, well, a lot of core. And yeah, it was real fun. He was drenching in sweat. We're about to shower after we eat. And, oh, you gotta pull a stick too. Let me take this out before we forget. Uh, hopefully it's something we can just do at home. <laughs> or something slight. This is our little, not really day jar, but you know, activity jar, I guess, or day jar or something like that. Why is he getting up here like this something for him? <laughs> so he gonna pull a stick and then we gonna see what he get and then see if we can do that today. <laughs> you see I'm turning this head for me. <laughs> Oh, we already did that. Oh yeah, that one puts me in there. It said climb Pinnacle Mountain. We already climbed the mountain. And I sure ain't doing that today. <laughs> <laughs> That's over with. <sighs> Make a homemade pizza. What you planned on cooking today? Put that in one more. One more. It's gonna have to be an either or. Both. Either or, which one? You trying to bowl or you trying to make a piece? I asked you. I asked you. <laughs> which one are you? I asked you. I asked you. <laughs> I picked two of them. Now you make the final. Oh my gosh. No, because I want to do a pizza. <laughs> okay, I'm making a piece one. A man that organized, okay? Period. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Doing it all by himself. Mm -hmm. We're at the at-home store and I forgot my camera. What kind of vlogger am I forgetting my camera? But I came here for table placements. <laughs> I came here for placements, like new placements since I got new... Um, furniture and stuff like that. Ooh, the silver. That's cute. See, I was torn between between doing silver or black. Let me see. So these are the placements that I'm thinking of getting. Well, that I am gonna get. So I have black, and then like a black bowl, or I can do, nah, silver. No. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> If I would've got a different placement, then I could've did. Okay, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> that is 50% off 90. Yeah. 45? We slow. <laughs> Okay, so from the at-home store, I put in a few clips. I got some more like table placements, if you will. So I got these two plates. They're not glass, they're like, honestly like wood, plastic. So I decided to get these because they got a cute little design on them. I got two of them for $6.99 each, but I did have a 15% off coupon. So we're gonna be switching out this white, I believe, for the black. <laughs> Just go away. My bad. And then I got some table, what is these, placemats, if you will. So yeah, black with the, it's like brown. We gonna see. Let's try to like set one up kinda. I was scared to get square because I didn't want it to be too big, but honestly, Cause I had circle last time, but I think square is okay. What if I put a white plate on the black plate? Nah, I think I should get, yeah. I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree and get some um, black plates and bowls to do that because that's how they had it. 
They actually kind of had two bowls. They had like a plate bowl and then they had a regular bowl on here. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. But I think I like this little placemat right there. I think that's cute. Yeah, that definitely makes it look a lot better rather than that brown, which is still kind of got like brownish in it, but the whole placemat being brown, I don't think that's cute, girl. So I may buy some bowls to put on top of here, or I may just keep it like this because, you know, I like to eat off, sometimes I eat off plastic plates and then sometimes we eat off, a, um, well, a lot of times I eat off a glass plate. So honestly, we can just put our food plate on this and like eat, I guess, but how do I? I'm supposed to wash this. Okay, not food safe. <laughs> so, yeah, we're just gonna have to remove this. Cause this is like wood plastic, so this is not an actual plate. But I think I like this. And then I can still have my little napkin right here. I don't know if I should keep this like neutral brown right here or if I should change that out for a black one. Probably not black. I think I like it. For right now, it definitely looks 10 times better than what it looked like before. So yeah, I'm feeling this. This just feels like I'm in a house. Like, I absolutely love this. And I'm definitely probably gonna move this money tree out the way and get some other like centerpiece because this color planter is definitely throwing me off. I do have a white planter that I can put right here, but I may just go ahead and just move that all together and then get some other little like mini centerpiece and yeah this is coming together really really nicely i absolutely love it Bay said he liked the chairs counter cornered like this slanted so i'm just going to keep them like that it feels like it makes the space more open too like i kind of like that but obviously when we sit down to eat we're going to be sitting face to face and then i don't know if i want to show y'all what i want to get right here yet or not but i already know what i'm about to get right here it's going to be really cute it's a silver art piece it's not a canvas or anything like that i'm like super tired of the canvas look and not saying that I wouldn't get a canvas again but basically like just having a plain white canvas with like some type of art on it is just not my vibe no more <laughs> like I really want texture I want details I want something that's like basically coming up off the wall and this new piece that I got it is a hundred dollars but it comes with six different pieces and it's going to be so cute and it's silver and I know it's just going to set this oh okay so i'm super excited about that um it's gonna take up all of that wall i think it'll be cute with my chandelier because this is silver so yeah this i'm getting it together baby i'm getting it together <clears throat> once i get that piece this whole dining room space will definitely be done the next thing that i want to work on is over here in this corner i was thinking of getting a bookshelf to put over there and i think that'd be really cute um yeah, I think I may put a bookshelf over there, but y'all know that is my corner to where I like to, oh, excuse me, where I like to do um like clothing hauls and stuff because I like the um hardwood floor and the natural light that comes directly in on me. So I don't know, we'll see, but I do know I want a bookshelf. And there's really nowhere else to put the bookshelf, <laughs> if we're being quite honest. And I think that'll just be really cute to put a bookshelf over there. One of them right here came out really nice. If you just look a little too close, then you'll be able to see like how it kind of dripped a little bit. But other than that, we're good. I went ahead and sprayed the middle of this one, but the other one I didn't spray the middle. And then the other one is right here. So I decided just to put it in here. I like it, it's cute. Cause depending on what type of candle I get, I kind of want to hide the candle. Cause Christmas is about to come up and Halloween and you know, Thanksgiving and you know, the candles pumpkin spice more than likely it's going to be orange i don't want no orange you know candle sitting out so at least that can kind of disguise it a little bit because this one instead of just setting the candle on here and having orange out i can hide the candle so yeah i'm really loving it um, i'm just loving it like this is my dream apartment this is my dream ah! i am living in my prayer i am living in my prayer i just wanted to say that like literally you just got to slow down a little bit in life because honestly you be wanting this one that this to happen this to happen baby i prayed for this i prayed for this exact apartment when i came to take a tour of this apartment i knew it was mine i prayed for this exact apartment i am living in my prayer i am living in everything that i said i wanted to do and have my business my apartment my man like baby 
because yes that is why i think i said i think i said last night i just feel so blessed like it just came to my attention that like i'm really living in my prayer like it's just such a fulfilling joy and fulfillment i don't know it's it's just it's just great so my apartment is almost finished we're gonna be doing an apartment tour pretty soon for sure like my living room and dining room space is definitely about to be done and my kitchen is already done like i'm not adding anything else to my kitchen now the bedroom i still gotta do a little bit more to this i just need my tv mounted and then i need to find something to put above my bed and then also i need to buy more wallpaper for right there and honestly that may be it i do kind of want a seating area in here but i just need a few more touches and i'm done my guest bathroom is done my guest room is honestly i'll say my guest room is about like 85 percent done because i got a new debt like y'all know y'all saw the transformation and then the next thing would be my master bathroom my master bathroom i do feel like it's plain but i feel like it's plain because I want some type of picture or wallpaper right here. I'll probably just do a picture just to ease my mind. And then, like, my shower stuff, that's already organized. That's good. My closet is organized. We're good here. It's just, I feel like it's incomplete because I need to organize my cabinets and stuff. Like, girl, I don't even have basically anything in here. And nothing is really just organized. So, it's like, you know, nothing in here. Those are all my bonnets. There's one little thing in here literally that random stuff right here that's random the only two that i really use is these two and this side is my boyfriend's side and then under here i got like tissue paper towels and stuff like that so i think it just feels incomplete because nothing is organized but <clears throat> i did you know i did some stuff to make it feel a little bit more homey so honestly we just honestly got a few more finishing touches <laughs> to do i feel like definitely by christmas i should have an apartment tour out for y'all because everything's coming together like it, it just it just looks really good in here especially my living room space so yeah i'm excited i'm gonna stop rambling now i've been talking for almost 10 minutes so i'm about to take prints outside and then i'm going to get back on the camera when i decide to cook my meal from my cookbook i do want to cook at least one meal out my cookbook like one meal a week um, I'm actually about to do two meals, I think, this week, but at least by Christmas, I need to have all of those meals cooked in that cookbook, because I got, I wanted the cookbook to cook, like, I don't want to just look at it for it to collect dust, so, yes, I'm just so excited, okay, now I'm going to take my son out, <laughs> so this is what I'm going to be cooking, if y'all saw my Christmas vlog, I think I showed y'all, this is the book I got from Amazon, A Heart Soul Food by Rosie Mays, um, her food looked really good in this so this is a meal i let Bay pick out of like two different dishes what he wanted and he picked this one y'all know i kind of already cooked this meal it's just smothered chicken um, i'm just going to follow this recipe because you know i wanted to just use the book but i kind of already make this y'all know with the cream of chicken and you know i have put my potatoes and stuff in there what i call my famous meal but i'm just going to follow this and kind of do it slightly a little bit different um and yeah this this will be about to cook tonight so i got all my ingredients i'm about to kind of clear off this my cooking space because it's uh, yeah love you Well, my life can just went out. Now I gotta put another maintenance request in here. These two work and it looks kind of dark. These two lights are out. Ugh, that is so annoying. Okay, false alarm. I guess I didn't flip the switch all the way. They all work. <laughs> Struggle, ugliness, and the success. Hear my words and listen to my signal of distress. I grew up the chicken until it's golden brown. Some of my niggas down the block, man, we were blessed. And life can't be no fairy tale, no once upon a time. But I'll be so I just took this chicken out, and he was like, Man, you might want to cook that tomorrow. It's okay, babe. It's gonna be on there for 45 minutes, okay? Okay. Listen, this is what you find. 
Good news is, nigga, you came a long way. Bad news is, nigga, you went the wrong way. Being broke is better. Life that's better than yours. Who's this thing? It's a life that's better than yours. Think being broke is better. Life that's better than yours. No such thing. No such thing. For what's money without happiness? Or hard times without the people you love? I'm not sure okay, so the food is done, mac is done, homemade mashed potatoes are done, got some corn, yeah, and then the chicken, some mother chicken, I'm gonna do a mini haul. Today is Tuesday, August 15th. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it is Tuesday the 15th, as y'all saw. Bay is out on my patio spray painting um, the little cubicle that I was telling y'all that I'm gonna give to him. He wanted black, so he spray painted it black. We bought some spray paint from Walmart. We also got a lot of stuff to make us a homemade pizza. Um, y'all saw us pull the little sticky. Well, a little stick and the stick that we pulled it said to do a homemade pizza so we're gonna do that today oh we got butter in here too butter got in the fridge so we got that and then from walmart y'all saw I already fed prince one of these these are the caesar eight count two variety um like wet food but it's like real chicken and stuff um it's just little toppers like you don't just feed your dogs simply this like <laughs> your dog's gonna need more to eat than this prince used to love these when i used to work at big lots fun fact if you are new here um i used to work at big lots for about a year and a half that's kind of how i saved up and got my you know first apartment and stuff and, and plus the stimulus checks but yeah these are just like real food and he loves them so i put it on on top of his kibble so the kind that i just gave him was i think the beef beef chicken purple potatoes green beans and red rice so baby he didn't just ate it up i went ahead and fed him because i saw him going over there he was already about to start eating his kibble or he was eating his kibble so i just decided to put this on top so we're gonna take him out let him do his business and then we're gonna come back and cook our pizza but we did go to marshall's we went to the gym also today and uh bae got some thera breath y'all know i love this too i put him on <laughs> <laughs> And then he likes this, uh, what is this? Natural, all men's natural soap. If y'all know, or if y'all, I think some of y'all had said something about, y'all had, um, somebody had said something about this when I showed this. I think I got it for him for Christmas or something, but yeah, he loves this. It smells amazing, I like it too. And then from, we went to Marshall's. So from Marshall's, he got, um, a two pack of like cute little like brown pillows for his apartment and then he also picked up this um, sugar scrub this was $4.99 this is black cherry smells really nice I really like it y'all know I got my um, lip scrub too from Marshall's but mine is uh, when you do it it kind of tints your lip red and pink and he didn't want that so he just got this one I think it's going to be really amazing and it's a pretty big thing for only $4.99 and then I got from Marshalls. Did I say, don't mind the road. We had just got out of the shower. <laughs> so this is my first shirt. It is about to start getting cold here soon. So this was $12.99. It's the brand, um, Sincerely, Jules, Julius. You okay? Oh. <laughs> it's just a regular white little turtleneck not really even crop top just the shirt and it's kind of like half sleeve 
but the material on this feels so luxury like i don't even know how to explain it it just feels so good it's soft it's durable it's not see-through because you know white be see-through so i cannot wait to wear this and just layer this especially like i got stuff like this to wear to church too because you know it's not showing anything so got that and then this other one this is also something that i'm probably going to wear like to church or something like that so just a cute little blouse you know something a little more modest so and i got this in a size medium and then this i got in a size large because i can see it's kind of like it kind of hugs you tight but i kind of wanted to have breathe breathable room in there and my boobs are big i'm a triple d so i wanted to you know have some space so that's my little marshall's haul in one more haul um after he's done spray painting that like i said we're going to start making our pizza um you're probably gonna watch the rookie i need him to take down my sew in help me take it down because i do got some clip-ins to review and i really need to do the clip-in review tomorrow that way when i go to work thursday and friday i can just edit videos all weekend and then i'm off saturday so then i can just edit all day saturday so i don't want to take this out i feel like my sewing still looks pretty good obviously i would have to like style my hair and stuff but my hair did grow out a lot like my real hair grew out a lot so let me know if y'all can see how much new growth i got this is all new growth up in there so yeah he gonna help me take this down shouldn't be too long i'm gonna shampoo condition my hair have my real hair out tomorrow and then i'm gonna do some type of like clip up well clip in style i'm gonna have to check back in the email to see how they actually wanted me to style the hair and yeah we're gonna go from there but i'm excited to see my real hair because i haven't worn my real hair um in its curly state since i dyed it black i literally dyed it black flat ironed it and then went straight and got a sew in so i have not worn my black hair in its natural state so yeah i've been talking for five minutes um, I'll get back with y'all when we start making our little date night pizza or whatever.